welcome to this video and in this video is related to how the advanced team blocks work in Gutenberg editor if you install on active to this plugins it will be landed to its admin base you can see this is the admin base you can get support or you can also read the plugins up from this link if your installation activation is down and if you go to any web page or post and expand you will find there is a new category called team blocks and under this category you will get a custom block team grade so to add it and you're ready to simply drag and drop or click on this icon this is the initial stage of this plugins by default it is giving three placeholders but don't worry you can increase this placeholder or you can decrease by removing these single items so suppose i want to delete all of these only want to keep one items so this is our only one items this button is giving an option to add a new team member you can click on this to add a new team member so first i want to add a team member if you select you can upload from Media library or upload from a computer so i have already uploaded this team members our first team member is this and you can see the name of this team member is something like this so you can select once you select you can see it is looking something like this if you think that you have added it to this team member by mistake you can easily edit to this image to edit this image click on this icon and you will see you are getting an options to edit your image like i want to use this one so you can simply select this one and you will get to the updated team member similarly if you want to change you can select your previous team member image that's it it is giving to our three options first one is the name and position and shared bio of this team member so give a name i am going to copy the name from here and i have to remove this half end give a position like our front-end developer and give a shared bio i want to give you some dummy text like a lot of you some so i just copy and paste in this bio nothing else i can see our first team member is added successfully i can customize i will let you know later and you can see there is a social icons by default it is uh, facebook is uh, selected you can click and you will get a icon picker and you can easily pick any icon from here like i want to pick twitter icons and so when you select this you will get a an option to add the link for this icon like when to add to the studio twitter.com and click on this add okay. so our data icon is added successfully if you think that you want to add more icons simply click here and you will find there is a new icon to add this new social icon or you can also duplicate this icons like this and you can see there is two twitter we want to replace the second twitter with this linkedin simply sorry instagram and at this one you can see there are two social icons you can also click this icon to add another and by default you will get the facebook i want to change it with my linkedin so let us create another link for this linkedin linkedin.com or something like this and you can see there are four icons sorry three icons no four icons uh, let me add the facebook also this is our facebook and update to this 
url facebook.com there are four icons and tutorial if you think that you have uh, done any mistake and here suppose i want to organize this one you can simply move down and you will see our instagram is at the front and this tutor is the below so this is a simple way to customize the social icons so you can add a new team member clicking on this icon, uh, but icon or you can simply duplicate this one like i am going to duplicate this and i want to change my team member i want to do this first like gentle and this is a backend developer or something like this backend and again i want to you can also change this icons like and to make it this youtube and it should be a youtube account or a link similarly i can duplicate this one and change it with a new member like this one and again i want to change the name like johnny smith and duplicate this one like this and change the team member like with this one christian or something I can make it the sort of manager okay so we have added the four team members if you select its parents I mean this parent you will see at the right side all of the settings like this first it is giving the first tab as the number of the column there are three columns by default you can make it four columns or you can make it two columns or one so i want to cafe to these four columns like this and the second one is the row gap by default we have only one row so you can make it two rows or three and similar there is a gap or a spacing between these columns the default column it is 30 pixel on desktop and tablet is 30 pixel and in case of mobile it is zero pixel you can increase or decrease this amount like i want to make it 35 and on tablet it will be 30 or 25 and it's a mobile it's zero and if you go back to this photo you can see there is the photo ratio by default for is to three you can change it make it the one is to one something like this you can change the object fit like make it scale down or make it cover and if you go to this content uh, panel you will see the content paddings around this and you can change the padding increase or decrease you can also decrease this amount or increase this amount individually so unlike this and you can increase like i to make the bottom is a bit more like 50 pixel similarly you can change this fitting on this tablet and mobile view you can also control the alignment of this content like the left align set our right or justify so let me make it to the center by default you can select the text for this name let me select s4 position tick is s5 or s6 and the biotech is Fitek. and if you go back to the social icons you can hide or make it visible there are two types of visible style like always or on hover right now this icons are visible on hover you can visible it always if you select this one you can see icons are visible always you can control the size of this icon like increase a bit more or you can give a default value as 18 pixel you can change the vertical spacing 
waiting for it is 5 pixel you can increase like make it 10 pixel and if you go to the style section you will see there was a lot of strength like you can make enables this box shadow or height by default box shadow is enable you can simply turn off this one and you can see there is no back shadow but if you select you will get this box shadow similarly the border radius you can increase or decrease border radius let us make it 5 pixel you can control this border style if you make it now no border will be visible I will select the style like solid I can increase the border width like this or this let us make it one pixel I can change the border color like make it black or it is a bit white you can also change or set the hover background hover border color by default no background is no border hover border is visible you can set the color like this one and if you hover you will see the result if you don't like this color you can simply remove i want to keep this color background color by default no is no background you can set a background from here like this or this or you can clear all of this and if you go to this content you can change the color for the color for the names like name and for the position let me make it a blue and you can also the by color like this, this black or you can also remove this color like clear this color and social icons you can easily change the social icons panel background color like a medic this one change the icon color a make a white color like this one and you can also change the hover color so all of these settings are down like on a hover color or something like this if everything is done simply publish or update and if you go to the, check out this front end you will see our result you can see this is our team member section and it is a really looking better and this icons are linked for probably and this icon will be a work you can see and this is our team member if you select the hover style for our social profile area like the hover style and check out its look we will see the icons are visible on a hover i think you can easily create a team section and gutenberg editor using these plugins thank you